Hey guys, Steve here at the DJ Lab, and thought I'd do a little video here because I was looking all over trying to compare the effects between the S11 and the Rev7, and I couldn't find nothing. Everybody just wants to talk about a bunch of bullshit. I'm going to make this quick. So here is all the effects. Well, I guess we got to do it with a knob here. Okay, so we got Echo, Duck and Echo, Echo Out, Spiral, Helix, Delay, Reverb, Backspin, One Shot Spin, Vinyl Break, One Shot Break, Flanger, Phaser, High Pass Filter, Low Pass Filter, Trans, Kill Roll, Fader Pitch, uh, Fader Sign, that's a Sign Wave, Saw Wave, The Square, and then of course you have software, all these different software effect combinations that you can do with it. So there's a lot of stuff here. Now over here, I'm going to have to do this a little bit differently. Let's see if I can actually make this work. Because there is no real um, menu. So I'm just, what I'm doing right now, I'm just holding down the effect and then turning the knob. Right? So we got echo, time sweep echo, duck and echo, echo out, fill out, that's a new one, spiral, helix, helix out, the delay, the reverb, the one shot spin. One shot break, duck down, duck down is cool as well too, that's another new one. The flanger, the phaser, high pass filter, low pass filter, the trans, the roll, the, that's the, the fader sign, fader saw, the square. And I got the faders up so that's why I was doing that stuff. So that's the differences, those are the, um, the big two that kind of stand out is the fact that this has that uh, duck down effect and fill -a effect. And those are two great effects, which kind of make this the better of the two, to be honest. Anyways, that's it. Nice and simple.